from our Coca-Cola camera. We're looking over Birmingham Shuttlesworth International Airport. Clear sky, no weather trouble if you are headed out the door here pretty soon. Temperatures are in the 50s and 60s. A very similar feel to yesterday. And if you're headed out on a walk or a jog, we are looking good. We keep a clear sky. We've got that lower humidity uh, and temperatures are going to hold in the mid 70s through about 10 a.m. Later today, we will range anywhere from the lower to upper 80s. Very seasonable. This is right on track for where we would expect to be this time of year. We continue with lots of sunshine and the lower humidity, which helps it feel comfortable if you're going to be outside this afternoon or this evening. Our Friday night rivals game of the week, Penson Valley taking on Oxford. We've got a clear sky with temperatures in the 70s. If you're not able to make it out to this game, you can watch it on our sister station, My 68. This evening, if you've got other plans. Maybe you're headed out back. Maybe you're doing a bonfire. Whatever you've got planned. Feeling pretty good. That's 73 degrees at 8 p.m. 70 degrees right at 10 under a mostly clear sky. I don't have any rain in the forecast today or throughout the entire weekend. Now all of our college football teams are at home and that means a wonderful forecast. We've got high pressure in place which means lots of sunshine and temperatures are going to hold in the upper 80s which is right on track for where we would expect to be this time of the year. Throughout those games, these temperatures will eventually dip into the low 80s. Your weekend forecast features a lot of sunshine, so maybe you're trying to get a couple pool days in, your last couple of pool days. Looking good for that. We've got a full sunshine, upper 80s, and uh, as we take a look at the tropics, we do have to still track Tropical Storm Fiona, but the good news is that it still looks as if this system is going to continue on a westward track and then take a northward jog here uh, pretty soon. So we are not expecting this to enter into the Gulf of Mexico. Of course, we'll keep an eye on it, but most of the models are coming into pretty good agreement that this will not impact the north central Gulf Coast. Looking at the next 10 days close to home, we've got lots of sunshine. I have a completely dry forecast over the next 7 to 10 days.